Unser nächster Redner ist jemand, dessen Anwesenheit an einen sehr geschichtsträchtigen Tag für die Menschen in Berlin erinnert. Vor 48 Jahren hieß Berlin einen großen amerikanischen Staatsmann, John F. Kennedy, den Präsidenten von Amerika, willkommen. Wir heißen heute Patrick Kennedy, Mitglied des US-Kongresses von 1995 bis 2011, willkommen. Bevor ich ihm aber das Wort gebe, werden wir noch ein Video sehen über damals. Governor Dean began his speech by saying how difficult it was to follow a president. Well, President Rajavi, I can say right now I kind of understand how he felt because every chance I get to speak where they introduce me by rolling a clip of my uncle President Kennedy, but I will say Madam Rajavi, thank you for your leadership in our time. My uncle, 50 years ago, came to Berlin to utter the words, Ich bin ein Berliner. Today, I come back to a free and united Berlin, to this National Council of Resistance of Iran, and repeat his immortal words with just a small change. Man Irani Hastan. Man Ashrafi. Hastan. My uncle's speech was a speech that echoes through time because it's a message that resonates today. The struggle for human rights that he spoke about that day in Berlin is a struggle that continues today in Iran, in the Middle East, in every corner of the world where people are struggling to be free. When my uncle addressed human rights in his own country during the 60s, he spoke about the principle of treating other people as we ourselves would like to be treated. He said that who amongst us would be willing to trade places at that time with African Americans in our country and be content 
with those councils of patience and delay? My answer to the President's call for action when Madam Rajavi said that we should have sanctions against Iran, I think we should, and my answer is yes. When she said we ought to have a war crimes tribunal for those responsible of Evan Prison, the famous torture chamber in Iran that has seen the death and torture of too many who have struggled to see a new Iran, I say yes to the war crimes tribunal that you call for. When you point out, when you point out the very real disconnect between us fighting against terrorism, against Azerbaijan, but then also calling MEK, which is opposing Azerbaijan, a terrorist group, I say yes, let's repeal the listing of MEK as a terrorist organization that only serves the current regime. And finally, when you say yes to a new day for Iran, I say yes on Nowruz as well. Let's have a Nowruz for Iran, a Nowruz for human rights, a Nowruz for democracy. And in the words of you, Madam President, Mitavan. Va Bayad. Yes, and we must. Thank you very much.